What is this? Another stream? It's almost like they appear by clockwork. Well, on clockwork. You know what I mean. There's clockwork involved. And time. And shenanigans. But you know what other shenanigans are here? Soon is now, yes. For I am here, you are here, and greetings everyone! It is I, Kikoski, here, welcoming you to the stream. The pre-stream, to be exact, we have the opportunity to get here, get comfortable, and get ready for another day of attempting to get to Canada. Hello everyone! Mayhem! Yippee! And there's Nolan, subscribing! Seven months in a row, ten total. I woke up right on time. Hey folks, greetings Nolden, glad to have you here. And Eddie Boo, and HK Traden, and Bahamut Zero Dragon, and Monkey Ninja. Hope no one gets jettisoned into space or attacked by bandits on the way. I, I highly hope so, but uh, who knows? How am I? I'm all right. I haven't eaten substantial meals today, and there's been some stress here and there, but otherwise, Things are okay. I have no general, real complaints. You have breakfast? Oh, I had breakfast a long time ago. A long time ago. That's because it was a long time ago. Ho <laughs> ho! As far as Death Road to Canada goes, we actually only have two more unlocks that we can actually get. And they're here! They are... Grappler for 15 Zombo points, and Dingus Savant for 20. Those are the last two here, and then it's the 13, you know me ones. A snack and a drink? Nah, I won't crash, it'll be fine. I've eaten a fair amount of stuff, I should be okay. I have beverage right here. There's a lot of stuff that we can trade for here, all of which is uh, 20 Zombo points. But we're going to go for the uh, remaining perk. Yeah, two whole runs. I mean, you presume that we'll actually succeed, HK Trade. I never presume that we'll succeed. Even though I've done a lot of runs at this point. Still got to presume that failure will be an option. As for character generation, I believe we have... Uh, do we have a continue game here? <laughs> we have that random one there, don't we? Uh, as for actual characters, we have one, two characters to make. Not many, just two. How close? Uh, I, I don't know. I don't know how close we are. I mean, probably as far away as we'll ever be. It all depends on what mode I decide to play. But for now, we'll give it a couple of minutes before we generate characters, because there are only two that we need to make, and then... We'll think about what uh, mode we're going to do. Hello, uh, Sintorkestra and Alias. There's Earl, there's Sticky Hams, Ziggy Zaff, and Dark Dawn Star subscribing 11 months. It's been a while since I've seen a stream, but you're back. Hello. I hope you're well. And there's Echo Hotel. Thank you very much for subscribing, Dark Dawn Star. It's always greatly appreciated. Thank you for the rock as well. Rocks are always useful. I would say they could be exchanged for goods and services, but in this game it's food. Hello, Godspawn. Been a while, glad to catch a stream. Marvelous. And Plasma Zippo as well. Was watching all... Yes, I, I saw a bit of that. I'm uh, hopeful that he'll last a long time. Hopefully much longer than I do in my hardcore playthroughs of uh, Minecraft. Hopefully a lot longer. So yes, I don't know what mode we're going to be playing. I don't know, we may play a long one, we may play a short one, we may play a normal length one. Who knows? Really, I'm looking for those Zombo points. Those awesome, awesome Zombo points. That would be nice. But who knows what we'll get. I imagine so. I imagine they've added some more difficult things, but hey, that's just the way the game is. And hey, Raylock, how goes it? I hope you're well. I hope you are well. I hope all of you are well. Are those perhaps references to things I've done, maybe? I don't know. We shall see, Plasma Zipper. There are many things I could do. So many things I could do. We'll give it 
one more minute, and then we'll go to character generation. I want as many people as possible to be available as possible people for characters. Although that said, we may be getting to the point... Well, um, one character slot. We can start working on yours right now, Harris. So you know what? Let's do that, shall we? Let us, uh, random here and start with this as a basis and uh, see what we can do, Harris. In this counts, I vote for a long winding road, the one that ran with Pear and not a bear was shot full of shenanigans. We could try a long one. All right, uh, Harris, what are we going with? Name Harris G T J. All right, can do. You seem to have thought about this one. There's a lot of traits, a lot of perks. We haven't, um, uh, we haven't updated all of that. Uh, but uh, there's a lot of uh, new stuff. In fact, pretty much everything that we can um, unlock has been unlocked, except for those two, um, like the trait and the, per the uh, two perks. Male? We're not. We can be. Oh, that's quite a chin that man has. That's quite a chin. Dude, dude. Baseball hat. All right. Uh, are we talking blue, green, or red? Uh, once we done, once we're done with this cod swallow, if we have time. Blue. All right. Is there facial hair? There's various types of beards and moustache. All depends on what you want. Large beard. All right, we got a large beard here. Epic beard. Any other things really we can change are uh, if you're wearing shades or your clothing. There are spiffy mustaches, true. But this person wants a beard, so we have beard. Body, can do. Are we being taller, shorter? A little taller. Oh. Uh, that's actually as tall as we can get, so uh, you are already at maximum height. So no. <laughs> you have reached the maximum. There is no taller than you, and everybody else who is the same height as you. A any changes to the clothing? We can do that as well. Uh, it depends what you want me to change it to. I mean, there's lots of choices. Lots of choices. I'm just gonna keep cycling through, uh, and, and kindly don't say that one there, because I don't know which one you're referring to. Black jacket. Well, that one? We can pick that one. Anything else to change, or are we good? Let's see how we do if we decide to save the character here if it's ready, but we don't know if it is. Let us wait for confirmation or not. We can. There's lots. I cannot give you what every single one of them does. You're going to have to look that up yourself, because otherwise I will be here all day. We have all of those, all of them, all of them, and them. Yep, thank you very much, Nolden. I, I couldn't go through them all individually. It would take forever. And there's Necromancer subscribing, and that's tier two, nine months, nine months streak. Ahoy! You got off work early today. Well, thanks for being here. I mean, I could suggest a thousand better places to be, but hey, being here, I'm exceptionally grateful that you are. Charming, okay. 
marvelous. What about the perk? I mean, every perk is unlocked and they're all level 3, so you've got a lot of choices here. And I mean a lot of choices. Bow and arrows! Archery ended up being a useful hobby. You start with a silent bow, 30 arrows, and 2 points in strength. Cannot drop this bow even in death. You make arrows for your bow between missions up to 10. That's pretty cool. Alright then. We'll save this character. Which means... There's one more character to make. Just one more. You know what that means, folks. We roll! Rollin', rollin', rollin'. Gotta make a character, and that means we've gotta have a mod roll. Well, Toro Link active four minutes ago. Okay, I really like the character that has been randomly generated for Toro Link. That is a fantastic looking character. But by all means, you can change the appearance, Tora. You can change the appearance however you like. Congratulations! You have won. No problem, Harris. No problem. Take a screenshot of it? I mean... I, hang on, let me let me take a screenshot of him as he is, and then we'll make him shorter. Okay? Ha, somebody wants a screenshot, so uh, we'll do that. And we'll have it be... Alma... Make him shorter! Okay. How much shorter? We're talking... That short? Tiny! Okay, he's absolutely tiny now. You know he's wearing a blindfold, he can't see. It's a blindfold over his face. Anything else we need to change about his appearance? Nope. What about the name and the perk and the trait? My day is going as well as can be. It's gonna go better now that we have a stream. Alright, what? Well, name... okay. If there's a reference here, I don't know it. Oh, I'm glad to hear it, Mulvanian. What about the perk and trait? Ah, fair enough. Perk is mega buff. Which means metal pipe and four strength. What about the trait? And our trait today is... You can pretend to do your own drum rolls, by the way. Mayhem! Yippee! Or you can just, uh, Uncle Pud there! 15 months! Hello! 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 Welcome! Thank you very much! That's so very generous of you, thank you! Well, somebody did provide a link, Tora, to the, um, to the traits. Uh, if somebody could re-provide that link, it would be great! Because right now you've got Travel Light, which is, uh, run speed bonus, one point of fitness, but you can only carry two weapons at a time. I think there may have been one or two, but I don't think there are many travel light people. Thank you very much, Noldum. Thank you. No, we don't. Ignore Bahamut Zero Dragon. We don't need more anime fans. We actually managed to remove an anime fan from the pool. How about Fierce Tempered? Alright. Where is Fierce Tempered? There it is! One extra point of strength, bad temper due to low composure. Temper can be good sometimes! Alright! If that's it then, then we're good! We've had a lot of people with anime. Excellent! Thank you very much! In which case, uh, somebody wanted me to change a character. I believe this isn't the first time we've had to change a character. I'll also need to know where they are and what page they're on. 
because we have 12 pages and I can never find the right person. Ever. Like, I never find them. It's like, where are they? I don't know. Never know where the person is. Okay, still don't know where they are, because I do have 12 pages. Oh, so, okay, what are we thinking? You're ultra fit, you're calm under fire. You going with specialist calm under fire by any chance? X That's a huge change. I'll take it, but it's a huge change. Pick up down zombies, throw a slam them, large bounty maximum shooting skill, two points of fitness, one point of strength, and City Seeker. Alright. Hang on, we need to see if Cod Swallop's actually done, because uh, we need to do things one at a time. If I'm bombarded with several, I'll lose track of all of them. Okay, you're done. What were you wanting to change, Mr. Mega Halsey, and who is it that we're trying to change? Because I don't know. And I don't know where they are either, so we'll have to look for them. Yeah, no promise I'll actually be able to... or actually take advantage of their abilities, Sinister. It probably won't happen. Because I'll forget. Like I forget everything. It is the third time. Yeah, I think it's like the third. Okay, that's, that's in theory easy to find. I mean, if I'll actually, uh... Fair enough, Echo. You learned something today if you didn't know that. Uh... Hmm. Yeah, I'm probably just... I probably scrolled right past them. Six. Ah, okay. What are we doing? We have a friend of Dog Oblivious. One of the many friends of Dog. Yeah, again, Bahamut, we have more than enough anime fans. So, what are we changing? Are we changing anything? Because so far you've put no suggestions up. He needs glasses. Okay, there are many kinds of glasses. Yes, you can, PGW. It, it, it's called having one. Is that the only change? Okay. Uh, because in this game, cats will just kill you. That's why cats will just kill you. Dogs are friendly, cats will kill you. The game will continue if you have a, uh... If you have a, uh, dog as the only member in your party. It won't continue if it's only a cat. On the one hand, I'm sorry to hear that you, uh, didn't, uh, see the run live, Rack and Shim, but I'm, uh... I'm glad you made your character, because you were very unuseful. You can! I, I, I wasn't saying that you can't have them on your team, Blood Realm. I'm saying that if you, on, if you only have a cat on your team, you lose. Because cats cannot become super trained and cannot drive the car. They will just drive the car straight off a cliff. Take this from experience, the cat will just drive the car off a cliff and you'll lose. 
Because the cats never listen. Panda doesn't need to become super trained. Panda is Panda. No, they landed a fiery explosion, Tora. They landed a fiery explosion. Also, I'm just going to ignore that. And think about the run. I mean, we could do a long winding road. 25 days. 25 days might be interesting. We've done it before, but uh, we have a lot more time to prepare. We'll have a team of super people by the time we get to the end. If we get to the end. Also, 25 days means more opportunities to get uh, more Zombo points. No, we don't, HK Trade, and I'll be very happy to not have Garth make it to Canada. Let's go with a long winding road. While I'm thinking about it, let's roll for who we're gonna have. I hope it's someone good! Of course it's gonna be someone good! You made them, right? It'll be fine! An inventive car nut. That's pretty good. We'll have a good car to start with. Also, and I feel like there's some overlap here. I feel like there's a bit of overlap here. This could be bad. There's practically a hundred percent overlap here, and the problem is it's not in the field of strength. No, the car very well could break down, because their mechanical skill does not stack. Well, maybe we'll encounter them, Val. I, I can't honestly guarantee it. I mean, we can re-roll if you like. Because really, they are, they are exactly the same, and I think this is doomed to failure. I mean, if they were both mechanic inventive, they'd be identical. Let's roll again. Purely because that's, that's a little too much overlap. That's not overlap. We have a gun collector who's charming, and we have a car nut who's inventive. And hello, Cav! We were almost about to have a run with two inventive people, and then it wasn't a run with two inventive people. So we have someone with guns right from the get-go. It's Bob! You know, that person that definitely isn't the star of another video game that we all know. You know, um, uh, Wallop Dude. I've heard about that game, Wallop Dude. I'm sorry, Dark Jade. But you wouldn't have made it to Canada with that team. Good old Wallop Dude. Yeah, everyone loves Wallop Dude. You know, you go around walloping things. Here they're doing a sequel suit. Yeah, I think they call it like. W wallop dude once more or something. <sighs> ah. I too one day may make it to Canada without exploding. Uh, didn't you make it to Canada, Sub Zero? I'm pretty sure you made it to Canada, Sub Zero. I'm gonna have to check my folder of people that made it to Canada. Let's have a look. You might have made it. You probably didn't, but you might have made it. Now I'm checking my folder. This is important. I have the folder. It's somewhere. 
No, no, you didn't make it. Also, I found one of my Animal Crossing pictures that I accidentally saved into here. It's a good picture. It, it's it's going into a different folder. Hang on. Put it in there. Hey! Inadvertently found something good. Send it to Twitter? No, that Animal Crossing village doesn't need to make it to Canada. They're in Avatarus. Also, you've seen the picture before. You've seen the picture before. And it's not a picture of Jitters. No, it is not. So when we get to 7 o'clock, we will start. No, we don't, Bahamut. No, we don't. And now we wait a couple of minutes before the long winding road begins. Well, I'm, I'm pretty sure I know what that idea is, but uh, we'll see if it ever comes to be. So we're probably actually going to be, ooh, are we going to be Nareem or Bob? That's a question. Are we going to predominantly be Nareem? Or probably Nareem, to be honest, because Bob can be relied upon with guns. What's going to be interesting is we're not going to have to worry about collecting guns very often, because we'll have a full set. We'll have a rifle, a pistol, and a shotgun from the get-go. I mean, we won't have much ammo for them. I mean, Nareem's in the leader slot, but that doesn't mean to say I'll have Nareem leading the expeditions out. I could easily switch. It all depends on who I prefer to have, uh... Yeah, looking for higher tier guns is one thing, but having the basic guns is important, because they do provide you with, uh... that initial level of protection. Also, if you're really high skill in something, even the low level guns are good. What we really want is another pristine, uh, or untouched Walmart. Yolmart, rather. Oh no! I accidentally referenced the place that they were referencing! <gasps> I think people pretty much by now know what they're referencing. What do they? If you didn't, I'm sorry. I have broken the immersion forever. You now know what it's referencing. It'll never be the same. It'll never be the same. No, it doesn't, Mulvanian. No, it doesn't. Stream is ruined. To be fair, I'm surprised it wasn't ruined already. Shooting at level 8 from natural shot removes recoil from everything, including the chain gun. Oh dear. Don't speak the... I'm pretty sure that's not how anything works ever, Mulvanian. Alright, Demon Dragon. Ooh, a pouch of gold! You thought they were referencing that store! Well, surprise, surprise! They, they weren't, but thank you for the bits. Greatly appreciated. Yeah, I, 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 I tried that, Bahamut. It doesn't work. Yeah, we did. Uh, we were not having two people with the inventive trait. Because we wouldn't get anywhere. Remember that run where Brincewind died immediately? It would be like that. Except they'd both die. I'm pretty sure I've agreed with you at least. Ooh, Silent Scribe just subscribed. How apt! Thank you so very much. That is so, so very generous of you. Thank you! Welcome! We're about to play some Death Road to Canada with Nareem and Bob. Bob from Wallop Dude. Glad to have you here. Glad to have all of you here. 30 seconds. You see, when I say it starts at 7, I do mean it. The run will start at 7 o'clock. 
that the half hour six is for people who want to generate characters or just want to chill out with me and talk about things. You real? You just realised what I'm referencing with Wallop Dude? Oh, -ho! it was a subtle one, I admit. Disclaimer: It was not subtle. Five seconds. And let's go. Nareem hears rumours that Canada is a safe place, free of a threat of zombies. With nothing to gain from waiting around Florida, she decides to brave the death road and travel north. Till we till now. Well, now you know. We have 17 pistol bullets, 12 rifle rounds, and 8 shells. We also have all of these guns and an umbrella. Ooh, a pouch of gold. Onward to victory! I hope so, Necromancer. Thanks for the bits. Also, we have a kitchen knife and an umbrella. Well, that's not great. To start the journey, we decide to grab some supplies. We're going to grab them from... Ooh, all of them are not good, but out of all of them, the rest stop is probably the best. Yeah, Quiet Factory's not fun, Quiet Hotel's not fun, rest stop is best. Yep. The group finds a rest stop along the road, it looks very quiet from the outside, which is good, because we need it to be. Also, um, we know that your mechanical is fantastic. Look at that mechanical skill. You're not good at anything else, Nareem, but your mechanical is one of perfect. Wits is amazing too. Your wits and attitude are also amazing, and your morale is good. Let's go! Also, there's a bin there. We want to check that out for rubbish. We got a knife! And we're terrible with it! Oh, it's gonna be one of those kind of runs. That's fine though. Aha! Okay, this room has... Oh, it has toilet stuff! We want that! And the umbrella will do for now. For now. Also, I see that even after a few swings, you're already getting tired, Bob. Hmm. Yep, goodies in the toilets! Alright, is what we want up here? The answer is no. In here, nothing. So all the stuff we want is in here. Okay, we want... Ooh, that there is a really good weapon. That's a baseball bat. We want this. Yes! Not even disappointment. I know, it didn't even have disappointment in it. We also have a snub nose. Ooh! We also have a snub nose here. We're gonna take that too. And then I'm gonna use the kitchen knife for no reason whatsoever. Uh, you, you, you should grab that. There we go. Okay, we are really, really weak. However, we've got everything we need, including a replacement weapon. What did I miss? And who's this amazing violet head person? That's Nareem! Let's go! Also, we have a really good car. Let's go! Meow! 10 food, 4 fuel, 47 bullets. I'll take that as a win. Also, that's going there. And this is going here. And you know what? That's going there, and you, Bob, can have the alternate kitchen knife. An alternate is in, alternate weapon. Yeah, that's pretty good for a first stop. Find a cabin in the woods, no zombies in sight. Ooh. Mayhem. Yippee. And does Daddy in there? Subscribe. 15 months, 15 months streak. Nyaam, 15 months. Went by like on wings. Oh, thank you so very much. That is so very generous. Thank you. Also, perfect opportunity to go out and chop wood. We need you to get stronger. <laughs> Nareem chops a bunch of wood. So your strength is awful, now it's slightly better. Morale has improved, you're tired. So, we've got to look for supplies. Ooh, well we have guns, so we need the pharmacy. The gun shop could have better guns. Yeah, the pharmacy's only two to three meds, but that's two to three Guaranteed meds. We need meds. We have no meds right now. Also, I'm almost half tempted to bring a gun with us just in case something bad happens. And you know what? I'm going to. Because we're really weak right now. Like, we are really weak. Yeah, we have no... Well, there's three meds. Well, two meds and a food. That's still good. 
That's it. And there are other buildings too. It's better than the zero we have. That is very true. Also, we have a gun, just in case we need it. But ideally, we don't want to be using that. Are there any other houses here that we can... Yes! Hello! We can go in here! And look at stuff! Like this! So I hope everyone's well, by the way, today. Also, I think we knocked out that zombie's teeth. Nothing here. Hey! Toilet fuel! Marvellous. Tired, but okay. Good. Well, not the tired part. The okay part is good. Nothing here but disappointment. You ever use guns? Yeah, I should switch to Bob, but right now, Bob is not tired. Also, that is Ambrosine there subscribing. 15 months, 15 months streak. Hello, how goes it? And welcome back. Glad to have you here. So glad to have you here. Ooh, another house with stuff. It's... Yeah, that's pretty cold. That That's pretty cold. Oh! Hi! That's a room? That was a room with three zombies in it. That was a monster closet and a half. Yeah, there is fuel in there. We're gonna go get it. And that's Bee Dragon subscribing. Six months, six months streak. Ooh, six months already? Yes, indeed. And there's Old Dragon raiding. Uh, I'm just gonna open the door for you, because otherwise you're never gonna get out. Hello, how goes it? I hope you're well. 32 people. Ham raid! Yes, indeed. Ready the ham. Hoping things are all right. Yeah, things are okay. 36 fuel, that's a lot of fuel. That was worth risking it. I mean, it wasn't that much of a risk, really. Oh, look! It's the room full of sofas. No, that's not ham, old dragon. I don't want that. That, 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 that's creepers. Don't want those. I've had plenty of experience with creepers. I ended my third run. Uh, that's not my hair. What if I told you this is just... Well, that was a quick run, old dragon. Uh, so, congratulations! Throwing furniture at zombies seems pretty effective. That it does! The group finds a street in a town that has traps all over it. Oh. Hmm. Someone with good mechanical can probably deal with this, can't they? Several arrows in the face. Very valiant. Yeah, N Nareem could probably deal with this because of her mechanical skill. This is a wits or mechanical check. Well, she's fantastic at wits and pretty good at mechanical. It's the town of traps, so I think Nareem is good for this. Mayhem! Yippee. And there's a real forever lucky there subscribing. Five months. Love the content. Keep it going. I do intend to. Thank you so very much. That is so very generous. Yeah, being tired shouldn't affect it. Nareem starts scavenging through the town, avoiding traps to the best of ability. She's careful about where she's going. Many traps are spotted and set off safely. Nareem avoids injury. Her mechanical has gone up to super duper awesome. Also, we have pistol ammo, rifle ammo, food, and medical. Oh! We can fix cars until, well, forever. That's good. Group sets up camp outside a grocery store, and there is another group that's been following, and will probably attempt to loot the play. Hmm. Hmm. We don't know how loyal our teammates are. We could send Bob in? I don't want to send Nareem. Surely Bob is loyal. Just look at his eyes. Hmm. Bob seems loyal. We've got a test to see what happens. I have a good feeling about Bob. The Reem stands guard outside as Bob searches. He brings back food! Look at that! He's loyal! Ish. Or enough. This is going well so far. I mean, I've cursed it, but this is going well so far. Bandits have blocked the narrow road. Ooh. I mean, I think we should just plow through them personally. I mean, we have a pretty nippy car. I think I think we should just plow through them with our car. We have a good car. Plow through them. 
The group decides to plow the car right through the planet robot. They take a lot of damage. Oh! Oh! What's our medical situation? Okay, we're not good at medical. We just used five of four. Oh! Outside of However, we do have an opportunity to uh, get more people. And that's Cow Mayor Help You There, subscribing five months. Speed bump? You're more than that. This is fine, though. Thank you so very much for subscribing. Right. So we've got the, the good food. We have you know me. We have someone with an absolutely huge log. Hmm. No. We have you. Who is selling... I mean, that's good. This, however, might be better. We could do a bit of fitness training. I mean, we have enough food for group training right now. And early on, a bit of fitness is really good. Hello, Corvus. How goes it? We could use that food we got. Yeah, get some group training. We just need this group training. Also, it reveals how fit... Oh. It reveals how fit the team is. As in, they're not. Hmm. You're not selling anything good, I imagine. We couldn't afford anything anyway. So. Uh, no, we can't use charm. Um, we can't use charm uh, once we have uh, done some training. We can't use charm here. We're just going to leave. And hope we find more medical supplies. I mean, using our healing will get us... Uh, will improve our medical ability. See? Got a little better already. Ooh, a pouch of gold. Medical's increased. It reveals how fit the... Uh, that was perfect. Yep. We find a new group. Tam. She is alone and wants to join. Tam claims to be experienced in medical matters. She spouts a bunch of medicalish jargon. Seems plausible? I mean, at this point, we should just take them anyway because they're another person. I mean, does it hurt? It might be worth the risk. Maybe. I trust her not. I mean, we could go without more people. They're a medic. We're taking them. The group of six Tam, she joins the team. Uh, we don't know any of her stats, but we will know if she heals us for two. She's not good at medical. She's very bad at medical. So we're stuck in a ditch, and now is a siege. Tam is not loyal. I mean, I don't know. If you encounter a clown, do trust... No, let's not trust them. So, you're not tired anymore. This is a siege. It's a one-hour siege. You know, I'm giving you the gun. Have the gun. I mean, you have a rusty machete. That's not terrible. Let's go. It's only an hour. Ooh, weapons. We'll take these. Also, there may be something in one of these cars. Ooh, how yes, there is. And thank you very much. Uh, my paranoia stuff pays off. Her loyalty is awful. Oh, thank you very much, Necromancer for the bits. Thank you. Also, we, we do need to be careful. This is an hour, but it's still something we have to watch out for. And also, Sudden Life, then. Just subscribe. That's two months. Thanks for the great content. No problem. You'll forgive me if I don't say anything else right now. We're trying to... Well, that's the end of Bob. So, that's a problem. So, he's dead. So, we've lost our gun person. Bob! We also kind of want all of that. We also kind of want the gun. So, uh, we're going to wait until they're all not distracted anymore. And then we'll kill them. We want that gun. That gun is important. Uh, you have the gun right now. Okay, you picked up the gun. We kind of want that bad as well. Tam got the gun. Excellent. I mean... You were helpful, at least in that regard. Right. Ground. Grab this. And we leave. It was nice knowing Bob. Bob got eaten. Darn it. 
Yep, they're eating him! Now they're gonna eat me! Well, the group feels inspired! Um... Medical or strength? Uh, Bob was also our medic. Um... I feel at this point medical might be very important. So let's take it. Nope, medic is important right now. Yeah, Nareem was lying. She's pretty bad at it. Oh no, actually, no, her medical is better, uh, is equal, is equal to, um, to Bob's. So, now it's what it would have been had Bob have survived. So now Tam is our medic. I'm pretty inspired after watching our comrade be eaten. Oh dear, terrible camping. I wish we'd have had that other person. Would have been great to have, uh, got advancements for three people, but this keeps food. Ooh. There's enough power to send a single message. You know, at this point, I actually want to siphon the generator. Because you're already... Do I want to siphon the generator and just get... Hmm. That's not an option. That's not an option, I'm afraid. I mean, I could send out a mechanical message, but a mechanical's already as good as it can be. Like, mechanical's already as good as it can be. I, I don't see what I would gain by sending that out. Like, mechanical is super buffed. She's inventive, it can go to seven. Really? The Rainbow has a helpful message. Everyone but me is a nerd! Well, we learned something today. We learned something today. Don't send Nareem to anything that requires loyalty. We learned something! That was worth it. We explore a very quiet city. Restaurant. I mean, pet shops tend not to have very much in them. Restaurant is what we need. Also, uh, we're taking that gun off you. Uh, just saying. Uh, we're gonna take the gun for ourselves, And you can have this, just in case. Well, drop. Tam is actually higher loyalty than the... Really? So Tam's actually more loyal than we are. Well, that's a thing. Okay. That's... that. Something we learned. Hello, Kenton. This room contained disappointment and a zombie. So, we learned. We, we learned something important, and that was that uh, Bob died so that Tam could be more loyal than Nareem. We didn't learn anything. We didn't learn anything, and we lost someone. That's unfortunate. But it's very early on, so we should be okay. Keyword should. Also, medical supplies. Pretty important. Pretty important. What happened? Um, Bob got eaten. Quite a lot. He has a... Oh! Okay. That's a room. That's a room? Full of things? This is a room with a crowbar. I like this crowbar. I'm gonna call it Tim. Well, so long, Bahamut. Also, this room contains fuel. I like this room, too. I'm not gonna call this room. Well, that's unfortunate. You do have that machete, though. Need to get you a permanent weapon at some point. In fact, have a permanent weapon. And that's Kenton Alkimi there subscribing. And that is a 12, a 40 months, 12 month streak. Prepare, we'll try, we'll try. Oh, lots of zombies out here. Oh, and that is a uh, necromancer there with a hundred bits there. I return with spicy chips. Well, I hope you enjoy them. I do not have those. Meat and etc. Well, hopefully there's going to be. Well, there's uh, there's zombies. This I was expecting. Also, it's gun time. Yes, this attracts all the zombies. Nope, not that bothered about that. Because it means we get a little bit of a breather. Which allows us to deal with these like this. Oh, don't. Well, that's unfortunate. It's crowbar time for you. 
I, I know we're not very good with this, but it helps. Oh, careful. There we go. And ta-da. In here? Well, toilet fuel. Or maybe something else. Nope, toilet fuel. And fuel. We're actually doing pretty well for fuel we found here. No, um, surprisingly enough, Lord T-Rex, uh, crowbars have been a pretty staple weapon in a lot of things. No, we had a toilet genie last time, so no toilet genie this time. We'll have to wait for a hundred toilets. And some change, because I'm pretty sure we had a few toilets in the, uh, at the end of the last one. What's a toilet genie? Well, no, I don't think we've unlocked that one yet, um, Alias. I think that's like the final toilet upgrade. There was, but it was for two fuel. Also in here, even more food. There's a lot of food here. I'll take it. Well, now they're dead. Is there anything else here? Yes. Even more stuff. Well, you know what? We're going to take it. Hello. Don't mind me. Ooh, my room's terrible. What about in here? Ooh, big house. Big house with medical supplies. Yes. We're gonna take all the things. If we can. No carry capacity woes here. Just gotta make sure Tam survives. That's a weapon. That is a weapon for you. Take that. Just in case. You never know. Up here. Hey! Shells. Hello, one sec, please. How goes it? I hope you're well. Broom! Not worth it. Let's go. Okay! Huge amount of zombies. We can avoid those. Ooh, another bat. Can you, can you take that? Okay, I'll have to get you to take that, won't I? Yes, I will. We're sort of... Yeah, there's no uh, carry limit for resources, though. That's what I'm saying. Like, there's there's a weapon carry limit, yes, but there's not a resource carry limit. I can carry as many bits of food I find as I as I can find. What if I told you there was a zombie apocalypse happening in this game, Cape Sword? And we're trying to survive it by getting to Canada, the only nation in the world that still has anything in it resembling a nation. Yep, infinite hamburger slots. Also, it's getting dark. We kind of need to be careful. I quickly pop over here to make sure that... Nope, nothing there. Let's go. You got zombies! I know. Let's go. Come on. Come on. It's fine. We'd explored everywhere, pretty much. And we're off. Also, car looks like it's about to break down, but that's okay. We should be good. We find an abandoned campground. Ooh, marshmallows. Always take the marshmallows. Always take the extra food. Always take the extra food. We can use this food. Ooh, car's broken down. Should be able to fix it. Easy peasy. We're back on the road. Lucky number of fuel. Hey! Guess who it is again? I mean, we just keep finding him. It's Nimbus Ordeal, everyone. I mean, you gotta take Nimbus Ordeal. Come along, Nimbus Ordeal. Not again? Yes, again. He's coming. He's coming along. He also keeps getting de -level. Oh! Yes! Group sees another survivor flee from a big horde. They run right into a shopping mall. This is a terrible idea. Oh, they're mega cheesed. Oh, they are mega cheesed. This could have been a bad idea. But you know what? I'm committed. I'm committed. Let's go. 
They're only small. It's only a small horde. They're just very fast and very angry. We'll be fine. We're not going to be fine. We have brought gun. We brought all the gun that we can reasonably bring. As in, we brought two gun. There's only a moderate horde. We should be okay. Nah, we're not going to get him eaten by zombies. He can't drop his weapon even if you do. Ooh, there's a door there. We want that. We want that door. Ah, shotgun time. Good plan. That's what these resources are here for. That's what they're here for. To get us through to here. Hello. Ooh, we found the toilet. More importantly, we found toilet fuel. Yay! He can, he just takes, I mean, he's only level one. He'll get stronger, and when he is stronger, he'll have a huge weapon that deals a colossal amount of damage, and that's good. I'm just gonna soften these up here. Hey, I'm not gonna say no to toilet fuel, because we, we can keep weapons going for a very long time. We can keep weapons going for a very long time on account of our... Uh, could you stop firing all the time, please? Thank you. I mean, when he does hit, he deals a lot of damage. Also, your weapon is broken, so uh, the lock got broken. There's a door down. There's all these zombies here. We have all day to deal with this. We just need to get him leveled up. We need to give him a lot of fitness and a lot of strength training. We, we actually generally need a lot of fitness and strength training in general because we're not a very strong team. We will get stronger. We're just not that strong right now. Also, there's an opportunity to take umbrellas. You want to bet we're taking umbrellas. Also, switch to this, lock that. There we go. Take that umbrella. Switch back. Unlock, lock. Back to me. And there we go. Aha! Will we better use Miss Cleave? Yeah, but I, I, I want the variety of being. I want to better be able to dictate when I use a gun. Guns important. Besides, eventually it won't be a problem. Uh, yes, if you have a whole selection of umbrellas for everyone, and it rains while you're on a walking event, uh, you suffer no negative morale repercussions, because you have umbrellas. This is important. Otherwise, they're not very good weapons. Also, there's a shotgun. Okay, we're ditching the umbrella. Because, uh, because shotgun. Always take extra shotguns. You never know when you might need more shotgun. Also, get out of here. There we go. Ooh, that's ammunition for a shotgun. This might come in handy, considering the fact that uh, we're getting close to a problem. That problem is zombies. This should be good, though. Just thin the numbers a bit. Yeah, he's like the guest cast member. He just keeps popping back for another for another show. Hi! Oh, look! More zombies! Okay, to be fair, that's kind of expected. It's sort of their deal. Okay, round here. Oh, oh, oh. Careful, Nimbus. Right, uh, gonna unlock this. So that you can... You can switch to that if you need to. I like that you immediately switch to the umbrella. I mean, out of all of the weapons, was the umbrella the one that you want to switch to, not the shotgun? I was like, no, 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 the umbrella, that's the perfect plan. The perfect plan. Hello, Demon Dragon, welcome back. Tam has priorities, and they're using the umbrella, you know? We're going back to the crowbar. <laughs> Okay, this is the last area. This is probably where the person we're trying to rescue is. And we hope the person that we're trying to rescue gives us some amazing level ups. Strength and fitness would be good. 
fitness especially. But strength also would be good for, uh, for Nimbus. Anyone in here? There's food in here. There's a fair bit of food in here. There's also all of you. Pow. 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 Out of ammo. Well, that's fine. Ooh, that's fine. We still got this. Poor Bob indeed. Yeah, Bob got eaten. Such was the fate of Bob. He brought us guns, though. And the guns are good. The guns have helped us out. We'll just eat these around a merry uh, chase. Grab this food. We haven't got much food. And then carry on. We need to go over here. Into the last room. That contains bullets. Marvelous. And a gun. We don't need that gun. We might as well use these pistol rounds. Because, you know, we got them. There we go. Yep, I'm, I'm not going to say no to more bullets. You know what else I'm not going to say no to? Finding you. Brenton says he really wants to get out of this place. Well, come along. Yeah, they, they have more zombies. So you've got to watch out in malls. I've been to some terrible malls in this game. Right, we're just getting out of here. I don't think we're going to be taking Brenton with us. Um... I'd rather not have a fourth random person. There are a lot of rounds here. I don't think we gained on rounds. I think we gained on pistol rounds, but lost on every other kind of round. But I'll take that. Buy you! He's like a tennis pirate. You don't think we want a tennis pirate? I couldn't tell you, Cape Sword. Let's go. And... What are you going to give us? You're going to give us... Okay, ooh, Nimbus Ordeal is good at sizing them up. Okay, Mechanical is dreadful. Uh, strength and Fitness aren't bad. Wits and... Mmm. Hmm. I mean, we don't need the healing. We don't need the morale pep talk. No, we don't need the healing. We're all at full. We're all at full. 75 bullets? I mean, probably just the bullets. All right. We'll take some bullets. Nah, we don't need the morale. Another car much like their own? Okay. We can dismantle the car for parts. This is like a good idea. The Reem retrieves parts and scrapped using the car. The repair takes a good part of a day. Oh! The car has seen better days. The car still looks all busted up. But look at that mechanical. That was worth it. That was worth it. Oh! Yep. We're amazing at that. Also, who are we going to send to Siphon? Um... I suppose... Tam? Maybe? Yeah, I suppose Ma Tam. Yippee. There's always a problem. Not enough subscribers. Well, it's all, it's it's something that is what it is. Also, not a rogue AI just subscribed. Seven months, six months streak. Hey, Okiko, forward to Canada. We'll try. Oh, we'll have Tam. Tam siphons the gas. Whoa! Ten gift subs from Clear Skies. Thank you so very much. That is so absurdly generous. Thank you. Really, that's so awesome. Thank you very much. Also, morale drop for Tam. Mayhem. And Yippee. Necromancer's gifting three subs. That's 156 subs that you have gifted. That is... That is so amazing. Also, Tam can cool it. Tam can cool it. I, I, I don't think we're going to use cool it here. I think we want advice exchange. We want stats. We want stats. Advice is good. Nimbus audio exchanges advice on different topics. Ooh, Friendly survivors and light. Told. 
look at that shooting skill there. I mean, Nimbus or Deal can't benefit from it, but break the Kiko! Oh no! 100 bits there, thank you so very much. The shooting we can we can use with Naraim and Tam, though. That's good! Mayhem! Yippee! Necromancer's gifting nine more subs! Thank you so very much! That is so very generous, thank you! Thank you so very much! Also, 28 food here! You have a bazooka! You're just standing here. Alas, poor Loretta, I knew her in a dream. There's someone with a chainsaw here. Particularly intense looking woman. She has a chainsaw. You don't tell the chainsaw woman to cool it. You never tell the chainsaw woman to cool it. I don't think you tell this person to cool it either. You can't tell this person to cool it. I've had good luck with that before. Do I risk getting the grenade launcher now? The grenade launcher is good. We have loads of food. Oh, so long, uh, Val. Can you hit yourself with it? Oh, you can. But we buy it. Buys a grenade launcher. You can safety fire the scene to a crowd of zombies. The grenades explode after one second. Cool. Let's uh, put that in here. It's already in there. Awesome. Also, we'll put this uh, here. And we'll put this here. And we'll unlock that. And we'll take this here. Nomi? We won't have enough stuff for Nomi. We don't have anywhere near enough Zombo points for Nomi. Also, are you just a... Uh... Your weapons barter up. Hmm. Uh, someone help me out here. Uh. Oh, actually, we can't tell them to cool it. We're not gonna tell the chainsaw lady to cool it. We never tell the chainsaw lady to cool it. It's not a good idea. Ever. Don't ever tell the chainsaw lady. Hmm. <sighs> What could go wrong? She kills you! Yes! She kills the person that says cool it if you do that. So you do not tell the chainsaw lady to cool it. Ever. Also, Death Road. Fancy houses have safes. But the last couple of times we've tried to spawn a safe in a house, it's not worked. That's the only thing I'm worried about. The last few times we've tried, it doesn't work. Like, we, we, we've had... The rest stop, the supplies are pretty limited. I'm gonna go rest stop again. Go for another rest stop. They're pretty decent. Sluggish near noon. We bring a gun. We bring a gun. Just in case. Hello! We're back! A dinosaur story. We're a little better than we were last time. Also, you fell from the ceiling. Also, food! Got an awards in the safe. Uh, random? But it's, it's usually not bad. You can get things like Uzis out of them or Magnums. Also, no toilet fuel. That's disappointing. Yep, this will have more stuff. Also, nothing in here either, which tells me that the other place is the one with all the stuff. Alright, what we got? Hi! I see a wrench, I see food, I see medical supplies. I don't see that much. Also zombies. Yeah, there are zombies. This was a little disappointing, truthfully. I mean, there's a big board, but not a huge amount. Pipe wrench is okay. It's a heavyish weapon. I mean, we'll we'll take it. Uh, that's not the that's not the thing. There's the thing. Let's go. That's pretty much it, though. Hmm. All right. I mean, we're bringing with us what? Five food? It almost uh, pays for the amount of food that we uh, we spent yesterday. One medical as well. That's nice. 
No, there's never anything around the back of the rest stops. Ooh, nice demon dragon. Excellent. Right, uh, you're not very loyal, you are very loyal, and your wits are good. Yep, Nimbus O'Neill stands watch. He manages to stay awake but feels groggy in the morning. This reveals his loyalty. 19 driving days till Canada. Also, people are not very happy. Perfect throwing rock. Who throws the throwing rock? What determines the throwing rock? Because Nimbus is very tired right now. No, Nimbus is really tired. Strength or fitness, like, Nimbus is super tired. Like, Nareem could try? Only Tam? Nareem is compelled to throw a rock at the hapless. She puts all her mind to the throw, the rock misses the zombie, but obliterates a small garden gnome. Yay! Not a bad result! Morale increase! Take that, gnome. I'll take it. Also, that... that fuel. Another trading camp. Ooh! King Edgar is hanging around the camp! He's been waiting for you to show up. You know what? You have Gungeoneer? You're inventive? We bring you along. Come along, King Edgar. You are now part of our team. Oh. It's the turret vendor. It's the turret vendor. I want that red turret so badly! I want that so badly! It's so good! We could if we sold things? No. We could get a green turret. A green turret is a good compromise. We could get a green turret. Can't sell Nimbus. We could get a green turret. Also, this person is selling shotguns. We could tell him to cool it. We might tell him to cool it later. We want a turret. Any turret is good. We're gonna get the green turret. I'm not a nerd. I have lots of interest. I go to sports bars. We're gonna pick the green turret. The Reem buys a green turret. Throw it on the ground and watch it go. These can help a lot in a fight. This puts us very carefully at a bad point. Also, we're gonna tell you to cool it. Cool it! He gets really annoyed with this. I'm trying to make a living here! He then starts blasting his shotgun into the air, menacingly, forcing the group to flee. We have a turret. We are not using this turret until we desperately need to use the turret. The group is driving through a ru oh, a mall for one and a half hours. Right, uh, Tam, you've got a gun, and you know what? You're also taking a gun, just in case. Let's go. Oh, oh, is that the best weapon in the game? Is that the best weapon in the game right there? Have we found it? Yes, we have. We have! We found it! Right, come along, you two! Come along, you two! We've got it! Ready for it! Beep! 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 Best Beep! weapon! Beep! Beep! It's doing stuff! Beep! Dude! Another one. Dude! Oh 
no, it's empty! Quick! Swap! Keep this one for emergencies. You know what? Actually, the dude horn really, really helped. You know what it did? It kept them all on the ground. Okay, this is bad, however. More dude! Keep dooting! Dude! Yep, it's doing good! Excellent! How much more power does this have? Not a lot. What you keep doing, people? Doot! Doot! Oh, it's out of doot. This makes me sad. Sad doot noises, we don't have another. We're out of doot. However, small beef. The air horn. Yeah, air horn was good. You know the person um, when we had the irritating trademark weapon person? The ore. Yeah. I'm taking that. The, um. That person was really good. We did win. No, it doesn't recharge. None of them recharge. They, um. The only one that recharges is the one from the, um. The specialized person. You hold down A. You hold down A. I'm just gonna double check to see if there's anything else we need to bring with us. There's a hockey stick there, but realistically, yeah, the sports horn. Yeah. It's a good horn. Also, let's go. Siege complete. It was Uncle Putt's secret weapon. It was a fantastic weapon. Also, what are we gaining? Our reward is... Ooh, fitness. Fitness? What a reward that is! Yeah, Nimbus Ordeal's fitness is dreadful. Meh. Yeah. yeah. I mean, Nareem is getting better. I mean, no morale gained, but still. Oh, a campsite? Oh, we can pick. We can pick berries. We pick berries. We all pick berries. This is important because we're low on food. That gives us six more food. That's nearly another day's worth of food. It won't make a difference, not a rogue here. It's Dream Prism! He's a sound sleeper with health care. Huh, he's a sound sleeper with health care. I, I don't know. I don't know. Tam actually, like, look at Tam's fitness. Look at Tam's fitness. I mean, how much does um, healthcare give you in terms of medical at this point? Ditch Nimbus? But Nimbus! We worked hard on Nimbus! He's got a Guster Sword! Sound Sleeper is good too. Sound Sleeper is good too. Huh. If we're going to ditch anyone, it'd be Tam. You know what? Let's get rid of Tam. Tam has served her purpose. I mean, she's getting strong, but... We'll recruit Dream Prism. He also comes with medical. Uh, because we have Dream Prism. And Dream Prism is one of the custom characters. Also, medical. He comes with medical. He's also a sound sleeper. Mm. Loot quickly and run. This never works well. If you stay. We do a quick search. We grab pistol ammo. We run. We don't stay. It never ends well. Also, an extra torp. Oh! It's the extra large can of baked beans, everyone! It's the extra large can of baked beans! We're all super tired! It should totally be Nareem that goes to get it. Climb that pile! She climbs the garbage pile, it collapses. Yeah, she's hurt. That's okay though. We got the food. We can heal that injury. Okay, he's pretty good with medical. That's not bad. 
This is fine. Three food is important. Car's broken down. We fix it again. This car is doing good. Yeah, the fitness increased by, by, by climbing the trash. Okay. Small suburb or a swarm department. Bearing in mind we're tired, we may want to try the suburb. We may want to try the suburb. Yeah. Both are not good for loot. Well, suburb. The group drives to a ruined suburb. There's a few buildings that look like they haven't been completely trashed. This is going to be fine. This will be fine. And then it wasn't fine. <coughs> not much difference. Well, we've got a good team here. You've got a terrible weapon, though. Have a crowbar. Also, you have a golf club. Have a crowbar. Also, yeah, this is good. Let's go. Let's see what we find. Ooh, bullets. There were bullets in the entrance hall. And that's a medical spray we've already gained no matter what we find. That's three health on tap, and that is very good. Here's a reminder, you can scavenge sounds thoroughly if you have the paranoid team member, but we didn't. I don't think he's paranoid, but if he is, oh well, we've gone past it. We picked up a spoon there, we didn't want that. But look at all the food here, I say, this was a very wise decision. Hey, we've got ten food, that's a day's worth. Let's go this way to the left, and hey, a zombie! And lots of chairs, we don't call this room the disappointment room. There's an axe, that's quite good. Hey, you should take that dream prism. I don't know how good you are with it, but it's an axe. And it will do. If we keep on singing, maybe we'll find more loot. That's not how the game works, but I don't care. I feel like singing. There's zombies here, and I got bit. I think the song is over. Yes, it is. Oh, well. And there's Wally the Wolf there. Subscribing 15 months, 15 months streak. Good luck on the run. I think we'll need it. That song got me bit. Actually, no, the zombie got me bit. It's gaming the system by seeing that's not how it works, but I'd like to think that's how it works. Let's go. We've got plenty of medical. We even have a semi-dedicated medic now. Ooh, bullets. Actually, rifle rounds, technically. Nimbus is definitely paranoid. Oh, fair enough. Alright, good to know. Ooh, this is a room you don't see very often. It's got a hammer in it. We don't need the hammer, but hey, let's go. This room is pointless. Not even gonna leave the door open. Have fun. This room had a box. The box contained bullets. We like bullets. This room was pointless though. Yep, yeah, just a claw hammer. Not interesting. Hey zombies, how you doing? We're going this way. Moth! Ooh, that's just medical on the floor. Everyone likes medical on the floor. Medical on the floor. Everybody try to survive the zombie apocalypse. It, it doesn't really bother for time, does it? It doesn't really bother for time. Got 144 people here, by the way. Super glad to have you all here. Floor ice cream gives you health. Eat your food. Don't shoot it. Yeah, I. I ooh. Just. Random gun. You know what? Random gun? Sure, take random gun. We have a lot of people watching, and I'm always glad to have people watching. I, I personally hope there won't be trash can chicken. You know why? Trash can chicken. Also, I went in this room. It was disappointing. Oh, hi, zombies. How you doing? Please don't eat my face. I need my face. There's a door here, though. No, don't shoot the food! Elf always shoots the food. Also, more food, by the way. More food! And fuel! Look at how much stuff we're finding here! For a small suburb, 
This place has been fantastic. I don't think wall chicken would actually be better, honestly. There's one more place here. One more locale. Full of even more stuff. Sure. There's a shotgun here. There's more medical. Edgar, take it. It's getting dark. That's okay. This is the last building. We should be all right. We should be all right. Okay, there's lots of rooms here. Is that another medical spray? Yes! Okay, they have one and two respectively, but still, those are medical sprays. This is another room full of food! Cool! In fact, that was medical in there. I like this place. This place is full of victory! And still more rooms! Okay, that's the end of the rooms. There's one more room we need to go- Oven had loot? Oh, that's good to go back. I don't have time for that, but uh, it was good loot! We have like one more room here, and then we have to leave before it gets too dark. Ooh, a pouch of gold! Koskia found Pinata Town! Hey, I like Pinata Town, and thank you for the bits! I like them too! Let's get out of here before it gets too dark. We're done here. There's nothing more we can gain. We have to get out before it gets too dark. Cars here. That was a huge amount of loot! Nope, no danger music. We're gone. 28 food, 11 fuel, 5 medical, 86 bullets. Four. That's a lot of loot. We're up to 46 food. 46 food. That's mad. The group come. Oh. We could totally just hotwire a golf ball collector. Yes. This just raises all of our morale. Look at that. Morale increases! And a decent meal. Cool! This car has served as well. I'm gonna be sad. Sad when it runs. Oh! <gasps> Gas station rescue! Go for it! Yes! We rescue the person, we get tons of gas. This is good! We like this. Also, uh, goodbye this. Goodbye that. Um, put the pistol there. Actually, no, keep a pistol out. We're not tired now. No, we're not. We need to... Can we combine these? No. Oh, goodbye baseball. No. No, goodbye baseball bat. We don't need the bat. Watch out for the propane as well. Yes, we will. We will. Let's quickly go. First thing we need to do... Siphon all of this. As quickly as we can. Okay. We got it all. Get in here. Get in. Out. Oh, oh, oh. We got bit. That's fine. In here. Uh, we're missing someone. Well, that's the end of someone. That was the end of our new medic. Well, time for you to follow us, Rohan. Oh, no, 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 in here, in here, in here, in here, in here. Well, there goes Dream Prism. I'm sorry, Dream Prism. You perished. There's nothing we could have done about that. He just got flanked. Someone did die. Yep, someone died. We got loads of fuel, though. That, that was something. We'll get the gun. Don't worry. We have to go past his corpse to get it. We'll be fine. I'm just a little sad that he dies. And I mean genuinely sad, because, you know. There he is. He got fuel too. I'm sorry, Dream Prism. We tried. But you got caught. There's nothing we could do. Well, 10 food, 57 fuel, and we won. Okay, he's, he's really good with medical. 
I mean, Rohan is seriously good with medical. Look at that medical skill. I mean, he'll give us medical training. Also, his strength is really good. But I've got to be honest, he's a really good person. We take him. Rohan is on the team. I'm sorry, but um, look at that strength. Look at that medical. That medical is really good. I mean, his mechanical is ghastly, but who needs mechanical when we have... Oh, that, that was... That was sad and unfortunate that we literally just replaced Dreamscale with a better version of Dreamscale. Also, there's a dog. It's rare to see a dog that trusts people. Eh, bye dog. We've got a full team. We don't need a dog. Hmm. It's the Ouija board. Will we make it to Canada? No. And then no. And then fire! And then fitness! I love just taking that, because it makes him more fit. And then he can just heal himself with some of the medical we got. There we go! Group camps? Ooh, it's gonna be a moose. We could heal the moose. We actually have medical supplies to heal the moose. We're pretty good with medical. We're pretty good with medical. Ah, Rowan tries to heal the injured moose. He doesn't know much about caring for a moose and ends up angering it. The moose flings... Oh. Well, he tried. He tried. We needed to be better at medical, surprisingly. A deer has stopped in the middle of the road. It stares at the car. Is Edgar good at shooting the the deer? Leave it alone. The deer quickly runs off the quiet encounter, lifts the group's spirits. That's good. Morale gain is good. Now, we, we have 40 food. We need morale right now, rather than... Uh, Apartment building was turned into a barricaded fortress. It was completely overrun by a horde of zombies. On the plus side, they seem fairly docile for now. Yes! Also, you have literally nothing right now. Have this crowbar. Uh, I'll keep this pistol on us. Actually, to be fair... Why have you got the pistol? Oh, you should have the pistol. We're running out of space. I'll tell you what, we need to do that. There. That's Nimbus Ordeal, everyone! It's definitely not Cloud, it's Nimbus Ordeal. Good dude. Hi! Well, uh, not quite what I was hoping for. I'm really hoping for the option to improve, you know, strength and fitness soon. Yep, third time we've got him! Also, medical, right there, to make up for the medical that we previously lost. So we've lost a few people right now. A uh, couple of, uh, couple of our, uh, people have died. Unfortunately, all the people that have died have high more medical, high fuel. Fuel is really good, because we are, we're doing a good job of keeping our car working. Ooh, is that more medical in there? No, that's junk. Oh, I was hoping for medical. I hope for many things. My hopes are dashed. Also, how is our... Eh, it's getting there. It'll get stronger. Up here? Ooh, bullets. Also an umbrella. The umbrella might actually be important. Taking the umbrella. Let's go. And that was a room of disappointment. Door closed. Carry on. You get very tired, do you, uh, Nimbus Ordeal? Through here. Door. Oh, hang on. Door closed. Is he evil, or is he just misunderstood? 
There's the question. That is a room we don't want to bother going into. That room is terrible. We haven't had luck training him. We'll have luck. There's plenty more days on the way to Canada. You'll eventually smash this down. You know, actually, we'll open the door. There was only one zombie. That's why it took them forever. Oh, hi, big room full of zombies. How are you? Careful. We're developing a good team of melee hitters, and that's important for conserving ammo later. Nothing here. We want to be able to conserve ammo as much as we can. This room's also a room of disappointment. Okay. Not all the places can be winners. Also, uh... Oh, hi! Also, uh... Cake OQQ just subscribed. Welcome! Thank you so very much. That is so very generous. Thank you! Great to have you here! Welcome! We're playing Death Row to Canada. We have Nimbus Ordeal for the third time. Also, I just picked up a spoon. Don't need a spoon. Really do not require a spoon. You know what? We're gonna smash this open. This room is also disappointing. However, we have completely cleared this place out. That, oh, apart from there. Oh, apart from the... Hi, Zombo Point. How you doing? You good? Great. That's one Zombo Point less to un... Why have the toilets in this place all been terrible? They've all been terrible. Can we have a toilet that's not terrible? They're conspiring to keep us from our toilet genie. Exactly. <laughs> I see what you did there, Coben. I see what you did there. Ooh, shotgun shots. Last door. Hi! This is a disappointing kitchen. How much food have we found? Okay, we have found a lot of food here. We are net gaining on food. We're also net gaining on fuel, too. Yeah, well, th this actually hasn't been that bad. That's not the way out. This is the way out. Down here. Over here. And let's go. Done all we can. We bail. We have 119 feet. We're doing really well at keeping the car going, too. It's that excellent mechanical. Remember fun? I had fun. Man, I miss fun. Group finds an empty spot along the camp. Yep. No, we're gonna eat and rest. Not today, Nimbus Ordeal. That's a rookie trap. I know about that. 15 driving days to Canada. Group spots a group of bandits that have set up a checkpoint. Uh, had to be someone calm and trustworthy. I mean, you're pretty trustworthy. We're gonna pick Nimbus Ordeal. We've had that car for 10 days. Nimbus Ordeal is very trustworthy. We know he's trustworthy. He has sufficient composure. We're on the death road and we have 44 food. And this is on fire. Right, uh, fire sale everyone. Literally. Hi buddy, how you doing? Everything must go, 30 shotgun shells, a sturdy machete, or a blowtorch XL. I mean, 30 shotgun shells for three food is a brilliant deal, and a sturdy machete is also pretty good. I say we buy both of those and we leave the blowtorch. Buy the shotgun shells. The amazing deal, these are so hot, I might catch on fire. Also, uh, sturdy machete. I mean, it's a good weapon. We buy it. It's an amazing fire zone. You know, I've always hated this location. Too many skeletons. Also, here come the zombies. Uh, we're leaving you to it, buddy. Also, I'm mildly curious. Uh, what do you have? Uh, nope. Yep, machete's better than the, uh, than the bat. We're going. Have fun dying over there. So. We're going to take the machete and we're going to equip it. We're also going to get rid of this, because no. Um, 
And you, to be honest, can have this. Seems good. We also don't need this. No, the zombies won't go after them. I mean, are they fools? We'll get rid of the ore. Let's go. Car looks like it's about to break down. But we should be all right. Again. Car's broken down again. Excellent, easy repair. It's overwhelmed by a horde and flees in the nearby factory. There must be another way out. Oh, it's dark. Okay, it's dark out there. We need torches. We also need gun. Just in case things go bad. This should be alright though. Next time the car will take a full day. We'll have to see if we need to, uh... Oh! Hi! 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 Can we switch to the shotgun, please? Okay, we didn't need to. Good! Good! That was bad! That was an ambush right there. Close the door behind us. Keep moving. Whew. We don't need a crowbar. We've got, we've got sufficient light weapons. Keep closing doors. No, no, like that. Like that. It's like this game is trying to kill me. Yeah, I know. So rude. Right, there's a door there. And a door... Ooh. Which way do we go? Left or right? Left or right? I feel like this might actually be the way forward. In which case, we might actually want to go backwards. I want to check what's back. This might be a poor decision, because we want loot. No, this isn't the Chaos Engine. If it was, th there'd be more special power. Uh, whenever you're ready, guys. Uh, nope, just me dealing with all these. Good. No, no, no. We need to go back and see if there's any loot in there. Let's go back. See if there's any loot down here. Yes. See? Bullets. Food. Food. And another axe. We can sell that axe. That's good. It didn't take too much. Loot room. Yep, yeah, you, you've got to go off the beaten path, even in the sewers. You'll find things. Cool things. See, there's a room here. This room tells me... Let's explore this place fully and see if there's a second... There's no door there. There's nothing here. Yeah, I don't think there's anything behind there. We previously just ran through sewers, but sometimes there's there's things you can you can get while you look around. Them. Sometimes. You also gotta keep your eyes open for doors. Sometimes there are doors. Time to switch to a gun. Move forward. And not the hatchet. Machete. Aha! The way out. Perfect. Let's go! We got two food, we got some bullets, we got lots of stuff. A successful result. Also, you can put these back. Also, you can put that back for now. And we can put this here. It's sellable. Alright, what is our reward? Is it medical? Is it fitness? Is it... Okay, the, the plus two mechanical is kind of useless. Um... The random skill, however, might be handy. What do we get? Nimbus Ordeals Morale, uh... Medical, shooting, King Edgar's Mechanical has gone up, and... Yeah, th th those weren't very good. I mean, Rohan's shooting going up is nice. Ish. Bandit Watch. Well, you know who stays up all night. Oh. Nareem got fitness. Oh, that's good. Hmm. Hmm. Who should stay up? Yeah, it should be Nimbus. Nimbus Ordeal stands guard for the night. He's pretty tired. Out of all of them, Nimbus would be too paranoid to sleep. We're role-playing everyone. 
And how's the generator attached to Group Storm's a working computer? Ooh. Do we siphon the generator? Could siphon the generator. Then again, we may want morale for Rohan. We may want morale for Rohan. Doesn't siphoning the generator lower morale? We don't want Rohan to leave. Q basic games would increase morale. Wouldn't it? The group plays a cute game about rolling some bananas at each other. It's incredible. The power eventually runs out, but until then, the experience is magical. We need morale. Like, Rohan's morale is struggling. Also, city outskirts. Do we have a rescue? Not the kind of rescue I want. Hardware stores can sometimes have fuel, though. Do we want the two morale? Or do we want... Yeah, we want hardware. Hardware could have a chainsaw. Also, so long, Space Powered. We should be alright with this. Let's go! Also, we're right by the place. What do they have? Fuel! Excellent! That is 79 fuel. That will keep us going for a long time. That was worth it already. Big fuel find. Also, you. How do? And more food. Cool. I like food here. Also, glitching out oven there. No way we're going to get to that oven. Oven's open already, anyway. Let's go. Hmm, nothing there. Nothing there. Right, this uh, place otherwise wasn't very good. But there's a place above. Maybe? Not there, there isn't. Here? Ah, somewhere further up. Uh, or not... If this was just a fuel stop, I, I I like it. It was a worthwhile endeavor. Nope, there's a building here. It's the last building we can go into. And there's a room just full of zombies. At some point, we'll actually get Nimbus or Teal strength up. We have so failed at that. Hi, this box contained bullets. I mean, Sandstar's kitchen's pretty good now and thus far. Hi, food. Hi, shells. We have five food, though. That's not terrible. Also, chairs. Ooh! Hi, medical. How you doing? Hello, bullets. Hello, more bullets. Yes! We need better guns, to be fair. But you know. Oh! Did I say we needed more food? No? Well, guess what? I won't say no! Not to food! Uh. I'm not sure, Mad Steve, what you're doing. Also, finally, toilet fuel. And with that, we have explored here. And with that, I'm pretty sure there's nothing more we can do. Yeah, please don't list a bunch of random items, uh, Mad Steve. Even if you are referencing a song. It's fine. We're good. Let's go. That was a day's worth of food, plus 90 fuel! Car's starting to smoke again. End of the day, the group hides in a drafty old house, some zombies roam outside. Well, we can easily pick someone to secure it. And that's Nareem. Easy, easy. 
13 driving days till Canada. It is, isn't it? While driving on the death road... Up... Ooh... Do we go with an apartment rescue, or do we go with a bookstore? The bookstore stats probably... Yeah, rescue's gonna be better, because we'll have a choice. From a distance, the group spots someone fleeing from an angry horde. They disappear into an apartment building. Also, I believe we have a thing now where whenever we rescue someone, we get zombo points. So, uh, that's a thing. And we like zombo points. Here we go! Right. Let's see if we can find this person. I mean, if we can get strength or fitness, that'd be great. Ideally, strength. Like, gaining some strength would be good. Nimbus needs that for the sword. But I'll take either. And this is where we're offered like, hey, would you like medical? I mean, I won't say no if the game offers me medical, but to be honest, I'll take strength or fitness over. They're both very important. Nimbus does need to get swole. Definitely needs to get swole. Okay, these rooms contain a huge veritable horde of no. You want some mechanical? No! No, we don't. Also, do we even know how strong Nimbus is? Uh, no, we don't actually know how strong Nimbus is, which is interesting. We've also kind of hemmed ourselves into a corner. You know what we're going to do? We're going to solve this by hemming ourselves even further into a corner and regrouping. With some space behind us. But we're done. Yeah, he will. Because, uh, oh, that's an umbrella. Surprising enough, an umbrella is a really good piece of loot right now. We're taking it. That means we have two umbrellas. Also shells. Are you here? Nope. But that looks like medical to me. And it is! Hey, hey! Down. We haven't been down into this room. Which contains nothing. Darn it. Let's go. Over here. Further up. Let's go. Oh, here you are. It's Tawny. She really wants to get out of here? Well, come with us. Come with us. You'll be safe with us, will you? Probably not. But we'll try. Ooh, more stuff. Okay, not more stuff. Nothing there. Stuff in here, though, maybe. She does have a good hat. We, we, we cannot take the hat. Can, however. Aha! This is the fight. Well, there goes that, but, uh, medical. And toilet fuel. It's the only fuel we actually have got very little here. We're actually net lossing uh, coming here. And that's it. Two food, two fuel, but the training might be worth its weight in food. Strength, fitness, strength, fitness. Okay, attitude is great. Composure, witness, um... Mm. Umbrella is also good. We actually now have a full set of umbrellas, I'll have you know. But, um, bullets or a rifle or shotgun? You know what? Give us shotgun shells. That was a little disappointing. Also, a new person, Rosabel. She's alone, wants to join the queen. Chains would be a great shot with a gun. Uh, apparently really good with a gun. But we're leaving you behind. We're leaving you behind. We've got a full team now. We're keeping King. A bee flies into the car. Even with the window open, it doesn't leave. It keeps flying right into the group's faces. This could be the biggest challenge yet. Swat the bee! You failed to swat the bee. What solves the problem, but you got stung. It's all right, we can heal you. We have the medical supplies. Yeah, that, that's pretty much what hurt him. Just swinging the sword wildly. Um, just go sleep. Car's about to break down. 
Ooh. Oh, vending machine. Box of bandage, a stick. Oh, we actually probably want the stick. We probably want the stick. Give us that stick. This is a very annoying process. Well, it's a good thing we have, um, um, hey Nimbus, you like putting things in here, right? It takes forever to feed the dollar bills. The vending machine keeps spitting them out. A stick drops out the vending machine. I'm not sure what you were expecting. It's a stick. Yeah? But if we get that event where we need a stick... Trust me. Oh. Right, um... Do we spend a day fixing the car? This is important. Do we spend a day fixing the car? I say we, f we spend a day fixing the car. The Reem pops the hood takes a full day. We won't be able to fix it next time. So next time we bail on it. Car is better than walking. City in the rain? Arcade. Arcades improve our shooting. But grocery store is food. Grocery store is food, but arcade improves shooting. Food is money. This car is good. Huh. We're going grocery store. Food is money. We need food. Why do we have a frying pan? Frying pan is not food. Disclaimer! Frying pan is not food. This announcement was brought to you by the blatantly obvious. Let's go! Back we go first. Ooh, another one of these rooms with a cabinet there. Bullets. We like some... Yep, there's food. We have... We have pushed this car to its limit, and my word, it has served us well. This is the perk of car nut. It could, but we could also just use an umbrella, PGW. That's something we could do. We could just use an umbrella. Now here's to hoping that the place we want actually spawns. Oh, there it is! Food in Myers. Or in Myers. Hi! I'm here for the food, um, not the zombies. If the zombies could leave, that'd be great. Nope, you don't want to leave? Right, we'll just have to kill you then. No, you don't like that? Too bad. There isn't a lot of food here, but there'll be enough to tide us over. Eh, five food in total so far. We'll take it. It's nearly a day's worth. Let's go. We've still got more areas. And up. Can we find something cool? Uh, two buildings is cool. Two buildings is very cool. Two buildings with lots of rooms. And a kitchen. I will not say no to two food. That brings us to eight. That's a day. Hey. Also, that shotgun shells. Also, is that medical? No, it's junk. Darn it. And upwards. And through. And up to here. Ooh, a pouch of Just imagine some dead retail employee going, Zombie Horde on R5, please avoid R5. Oh, that would be silly. Thank you very much for the bits then, Holden. Greatly appreciated. That's a... That's a lot of zombies! Where did you all come from? Hi! Greeting Zombie Horde! Um, go away! That was a lot of zombies! We've got the medical, but still, that's a lot of zombies. It's more than three! Also, this room is disappointing! Good thing we had a place to back up to. In Ooh, another house. 
Okay, that's some medical to make up for the hit. Where did they come from? Aisle 5! I mean, you're not wrong, they probably did. Also, 9 food now. 10 food. Some more shells. D definitely not a zombie behind that. Also, we, uh, thought I saw a sparkle there. Nope, we totally made up the, uh, medical we need. Anything cool in here? More food! Not gonna say no to having. Ooh, more medical. Not gonna say no to having a positive food outcome. This is the last house, and it's rubbish. Okay, we're gone. It came from aisle five. Sounds like a good time. It does, doesn't it? It really does. It really does. Let's go. This car, this car has served us well through so much. Let's go. You know, if this was a normal run, we'd be nearly at Canada by now in the same car. It also only consumes eight fuel, and that's really good. Ooh. Ooh. We'll camp with them. This didn't work out for us. Oh, they stole stuff. They only stole bullets and medical, though. That's fine. It was a 50-50 risk. We'd rather do that than not, uh... Ooh. Okay. Turn key and... Gu we want American guns here. The magazine's full of gun pictures, gun info, gun tips, and bizarre hyper-patriotic ranks. King Edgar absorbs all of these. We want the shooting increase, because he is a gungeoneer. Don't think I'm to cool it is surprisingly never a good idea. Not a surprise. Wait, hang on. Oh, wait. I'm like, hang on. We're nowhere near there. It's like, that's the thing that typically says that. We're 11 days away. Hey, it's a Yolmart. What we got? Flashlight person? The no. Tactical spear? The person we sell things to. Okay, what can we sell? There are a couple of things we can maybe sell. Um, probably some shotguns, to be honest. We'll sell some shotguns. We also don't need the extra um, hatchet either. Can't sell the pistols. <laughs> yeah, it's almost brought up every single week, but we cannot sell the normal pistols. They are worth nothing. Oh. Oh, fair enough. But anyway, we're going to sell some stuff. Sell a shop. Oh, we can't, we can't sell the hatchets, can we? No, we can't sell the hatchets. We'll sell the shotguns, though, for a bit of food. We don't want to be tired, ultimately. That's the thing. Um, I don't want to get tired. What else can we sell? Well, we don't want the wrench. The wrench is useless. There's really not much else we can sell. We're at 21 food, though. Let's see what we can buy. Okay, uh, snow me. What do you have? Nope. Uh, you are selling healing spray, flashlight, and a tacticop light. Uh, tacticop light we don't need right now. I think it's a bit late in the game for it. Or rather, we want to save our food because we're a little bit low on it. We can tell you to cool it. We can get a tactical spear for nine, but... Hmm. Also... I'm doing my part to keep civilization together, one anime sale at a time! I think it's time to tell you to cool it. No, also, anime isn't real. No! You're wrong! Stop it! No! There we go. Might as well charge up that cooler a bit. Also, that car's starting to fall apart. Also, oh dear. The group is surprised by a large horde of zombies while scavenging. They run into a house for shelter and to plan their next move. Well, it's a big horde. This is fine. 
We've got plenty of bullets. We've got plenty of shells. This should be fine. You take that. You take that. We've got this. We've got this. Quickly clear out the zombies at the back. And keep them from getting to the from the front. We can't trade them, no, but they only ever take up one space. I like having loads of pistols because uh, having loads of pistols means if uh, push comes to shove, we can always uh, just uh, grab pistols and shoot. Oh, we got bit. That's unfortunate, but we have plenty of medical. We have plenty of medical. Also, a couple of zombies coming this way. Can somebody else grab a gun? Please? No, apparently you don't think we need guns yet. We probably need guns soon. We okay. People, it's gun time. No, you, you seem very intent on not using the guns. Let me reiterate. It's gun time. Thank you. Just needed to clear out that small group of people. Now we're good. We did not want to get surrounded and lose someone. We've lost someone to that corner. I'm sorry to hear that, Plasma Zippo. The world is the world. And there's a statement for the ages. Okay. How's our morale situation before we... Our morale's pretty good. Also, we're taking you out just because. Gotcha. Let's go. Let's go, and... 64 zombies killed? That car is not looking good. Okay. Group feels inspired. Fitness or strength? Fitness or strength? Fitness or mechanical? Well, not mechanical. Fitness. We're not getting any strength. But we're getting fitness. I mean, look at Nareem's fitness now. We'll take it. We'll take it. Also, fire. Nimbus Ordeal is cool about fire safety, though. Nimbus Ordeal always has a fire safety plan prepared. It doesn't matter where he is, Nimbus Ordeal constantly thinks of new fire safety plans. All fire all supplies were saved. No one was injured. Nimbus Ordeal's morale goes up. We eat food. We are 10 driving days away from Canada. We need more food. We only have 13. Speaking of more food... Hey, folks. Look what we have here. Prepper cabins are good, but cabins with cars? New car could mean that we need the car. It doesn't matter what it is, we need that car. Then again, we only have 37 fuel. Will the cabin, will the car come with fuel? Definitely taking the car. We've managed to avoid the walking things all the time. So you know what? We're taking the car. Because the car... Like, we have done this whole thing without ever needing to get in, like, out of a car. Also, hello, Sleeping Dragon. Let's go. Oh, that's a nice car, too. I mean, I think it consumes a lot of fuel, but it's a nice car. Also, fuel. We can take that car a long way. Oh! So, uh, guns, please. Yep, there's the keys. We, we accidentally knocked the keys away. We keep knocking the keys away. Keys are ours. We only need one stick. There's a chainsaw. Oh, this was worth doing just for the chainsaw. Also, there's an axe there. There's a shotgun here. Why did you... Pick that up? Where did... Where did your weapon go? 
Pick that up. Also, while you're thinking about it, take the shotgun. We only need one flashlight. I couldn't tell you. Also, did you drop... Run him. Pick up the bat. Lock the bat. What's in here? Oh, well, I'll tell you what's in there. Trouble. But there's toilet fuel. We take this, we take the new car, we leave. Let's go. Yep, it could be sold. Right, let's go. In the car, get in. Open up the boot, throw some weapons in there, and come back and get the stuff we had to... Oh, that's a good idea, actually. Let's, uh, let's get out. It's a good idea, actually. Good idea. Grab the rest of the stuff. I like that plan. We can go back and get the torch. The nightstick can be sold. Good call. I mean, it's pretty quiet here. Oh, I didn't think of that. Anyway, grab the nightstick, and you... Grab a torch. No torch left behind! You're not wrong. Let's go! Uh, new car is not about to break permanently when we uh, when it breaks the first time, so that's why it's a little better. Also, we got some fuel for it. <coughs> 111 fuel. It consumes 12, but it's not going to break. A man in makeshift armor, made in athletic gear, is standing guard in the middle of a narrow wooden bridge. He's wearing boxing gloves, staring forward at the car, silent as he blocks the way past. I think we should just plow through him with the car. Cooling it's probably bad. I think plowing into him with the car is good, because after all, he is just one person. The group just ignores the armored man standing in the ridge and crashes right through him. Thunk. Car gets through, takes some damage, not a problem. It's already... Hmm. Shazzy took a fair bit of damage, actually. We should be good. We won't be good. We probably won't be good. It's Monkey Ninja 4! It's way too late in the game for you, I'm afraid. We've got to leave you behind. We've got to leave you behind. The group finds an inn. Do we pay the 10 food? Do we pay the 10 food, or do we say it, don't spray it? Ah, <sighs> Yeah. There, you must be a big shot! I'll show you the presidential suite! This means we're all tired, but we have to do it because we're not spending ten food on that. We only have eight. Nimbus will also refuse to eat. Save our super cool it, because Nimbus Ordeal already had a plan. Nimbus Ordeal calls the bandits on their bluff immediately. Before the bandits can yell, Nimbus Ordeal is already making tons of noise. As the bandits panic and the zombies rush in, the group saunders away by a side route. It pays to constantly plan for the worse. Save the coolant. We need that coolant. The group continues making progress. We could use the coolant right here. First thing we do is we uh, find stuff to sell. Like this, because we're going to need to sell it. The nightstick is worth a... Uh, also, we can sell that, too. Sell the extra shotgun. Where's the, uh, the torch? Torch is there. So we sell the extra shotgun, we sell the nightstick. These are good things to do. Is there a vendor for these... Probably no. There isn't. Oh, there is. Marvelous. Oh, no. There isn't. Darn it. There is not. Well, these had a good run.
Okay, what can we do here? So, there's Rolly. We're not getting him. He's really good. But we're not getting him. There's you, the pipe bomb supplier. No. There's also... You. The Blade Master. What do we get if we talk to the Blade Master? And tell him to cool it? I mean, it's probably not we can't cool the gnome. Do we want a Night Sword? I mean, we're not strong enough to use a Night Sword, are we? Nobody's strong enough to really use one. I mean, actually, you're pretty strong. Rohan has smile strength. Rohan is quite... You know what? Yes. Rohan tells the bandit blame us to cool it. He becomes filled with self-doubt. My life is a lie! I'm gonna give up the sword stuff and start collecting flamethrowers! The former blade master gives Rohan one of his best weapons. A knight sword. I mean... We don't have any more food! Um... Yeah, about that. Ooh, a pouch of gold. We'll get rid of that rather than that. I can imagine the super cool it has a lot of... It does. It has a lot of reverb. Okay, that's all we can do here. Really. Unless we can tell you to cool it after doing a super cool it. We actually can. Cool it. Let's start working on a second cool it. I mean, we have what? Nine days? We could do it. Ooh. We need that roadside rescue. Because we need to get some strength and stats and stuff. But we're gonna have to use guns. The group sees a person fleeing into the rest stop with a horde pursuing them. This person could still be saved. It's near sunset. We need guns. We have so much ammo, we might as well just start using guns. Shotgun for you. Shotgun for you. Undead Flood, we should be alright. We should be alright. Actually, you have this gun. You have this gun. And I have this gun. Let's go. In. 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 Find the person. Save the person. Find the person. Save the person. In. Where are they? I don't know where they are. Where are they? Come on. This is a little bit awkward. In here. Yes! You! Law says that she really wants to get out of this place. Well, if we live, this is going to be good. If we don't, this is going to be terrible. Maybe we should have brought the chainsaw. Right, it's gun time, everyone. And I'm not kidding. Gun time. Let's go. Time to use these guns. We got this ammunition. We might as well use it. If gun doesn't work, use more gun. I mean, you're not wrong. Let's use more gun. How long do we need to survive for? An hour? Party! I think it was an hour? Yes, it was an hour. Right. You can switch away from gun now. We should be okay. Yeah, there's toilet fuel to be had, but we kind of have to deal with, with all of that first. That's why we have gun. That was... That was tricky. Oh, it, 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 it does not a rogue AI. We had it. We had it once. It was fun. Oh, it does. It worked. It worked. Was there anything in here we wanted? No. Yep, stop raining zombies. We're good. Anyone in here? 
Ah, uh, just a couple of zombies. There's no reason to be in here. Let's go! You did, but the VOD's always available. Also, the person we were trying to rescue survived. Let's hit the road. Catches up with the group. Medical is terrible. Mechanical is good. Shooting is good. Group shooting training. Right, let's go. We'll take it. I mean, we, are, we have very little food. I'm worried about this. I'm worried about this. I'm worried about the lack of food. We have none. We're also running out of fuel. We might have been better off in the other car, to be honest. Storm descends. We need food. An umbrella shop. Uh, nope. Think we're good on the umbrella shop. I think it's camping supplies time. Also, no thank you on the giant pipe. You know what we're not getting? We're not getting lots of events that give us opportunities to improve anything, really. We need more food. That's what we need. More food. I mean, we're rested now, so we shouldn't have problems with anything. Oh yes, sword on Rohan. Very true. You know what? I'm actually going to give you the bat. Improve- yeah, we need a little bit more than zero food right now. The zero food situation, bit of a down. There's the storm. I'm sorry, what did that say? That was the anime store. Oh, if we had an anime fan right now, that would be brilliant. We don't, but we're totally going in there. That is a rare, rare spawn. And that wasn't even marked as the main thing. Like, we're going to a camping place. Let's go be there and tell people to call it. Oh, we will. We totally will. Also, toilet fuel. Very important. We're not going to buy the anime. We're just going to take it. We don't have the food to buy anime. You fools. What do you think I am? Person trapped in this place here? Yep, we got one food! We need seven more food. Oh, hi! Hello, huge horde of zombies just outside the door. So, this isn't fun. This is not fun! However, we got you. Okay, over here. The anime store. Hi. Dave doesn't say anything, but starts following Nareem. I guess he can help you out, but it's not like because we like you or anything. Cool. Also, Nareem finds an anime titled Big Bag of Pistachios. It's an anime about a bag of pistachios. The protagonist is surprised to discover that pistachios are sentient. Every pistachio is a different anime girl. There really, there doesn't seem to be a plot. Um, what happens if I read the anime? <laughs> what happens if you read the anime? No, 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 tell me what happens if you read it. Low Wits gets high morale loss. We have high wits. Someone look this up. I don't want to... Let Rohan lead it. read it. Uh, why are we letting Rohan read it? High wits lowers morale. Oh, low wits gives morale. Do, 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 do we need morale? I mean, we have max morale, but we'll have Rohan read it. Why not? Rowan finds an anime titled Bag of Pistachios. Sure, we'll have him read it. Rohan takes an hour to read the anime. Rohan is a person of culture and taste and greatly appreciates this anime. There we go. He's consumed anime. Cl 
Mine seems troubled and nervous. Not because of Nareem, just in general. I guess we can help you out. It's not because we like you or anything. Mark looks at Nareem with a quiet sense of superiority. And I guess that we can help you out. Ah. There's also a box of anime. It contains a bunch of anime girl masks. What happens if we put the mask on? What happens if we put the mask on? Nareem is now officially an anime girl. Nice! Nimbus Ordeal is officially an anime girl. Nice! You're also an anime girl! You want it in, folks! You're gonna get it! Full anime! You wanted a full anime person run? You've got it now! Anime everywhere! Also, this is Sandwich Chan. It's a graphic novel about a magical anime girl who is also a sandwich that lives in the refrigerator. Or maybe it's a sandwich that's also a magical anime girl. It's difficult to follow. Yeah, we're not gonna read that. Ooh, a pouch also, Kiko, you can try again as much as you'd like to get the version of the face you- Oh, can you? I can't believe my fiancé is some kind of fish creature. It's a comic about a woman who has a dreamy job in an office. Her life is brightened by getting a pet fish that has a human face and talks. The plot involves them having to eventually get married due to a wizard's curse. You know, if we can keep just reading it and getting the mask we want... Well, clearly, you know which one I want. That one. Rohan? Nope. Rohan? Yep. And finally... Oh, more Team Zero Cave! I guess we can help you out, but not because we like you or anything. Also... Oh, hang on. No, no, no. Nope. Nope. Yep! There we go! Let's go! Perfectly ordinary to me! Ooh, a pouch of My mister will flip when he sees this party! Best party ever! Let's go! Best party! Also, we're all armed with, uh... With anime swords, apparently. Is this because of the cosmetic thing, if we do that? Okay, we can still equip ourselves with the machetes. This is good, because we all picked up swords. Anyone with a tier 3 sub here? Well, if so... My, have you got a fun time! We came here for camping supplies. We left with memories. Beautiful, lovely memories. That will never leave. You know, you want to keep... What? Why not? It's beautiful! Why would you not like this? Oh god, what has happened? Nothing! Everything's fine! What are you talking about? This is all ordinary! We won't explode! Yeah, exactly! It's all fine! Also food! We need this food! Whew, we found six food so far! And we have a horde of anime fans following us! And junk. Ah, it'll be fine. I'm sure it'll be fine. Also, we need to actually find the camping store. You just realized something? What was that? We found food through th Yes! Through the power of anime, we found food. Also, we found junk too. Also a broom. Nobody wants that. That'll be fine. Ooh, more medical? Ooh, toilet fuel! Can we get more food? More food would be great. That's a room with a bed. Else. That's food! We have eight food, everyone! We have a day's supply of food. We also have more food! We have nine food now. Come along, anime! Together, we shall... Um, anime. Yes. 
I am one with the animes. Now we actually need to find the thing we came for, which was the camping supply store. Watch it not be here. You know what? I don't think it's actually here. Unless it's there. Oh, here it is! Whew! It's actually here. I was getting worried. Ooh, there's another machete. That's nice. Also by, by Katana. Nice knowing you. We'll have two machetes. In fact, we'll give you a machete. Also, I, I should probably uh, have that. More food's nice. We'll be looting this and then leaving. There was literally just that, uh, just that there. All of the swords are breaking. All the swords are breaking. Also, we're done. We, we found a food and some fishing rods. But that's good, because we now have 11 food. That's good. This is the best thing ever. Also, our car was up here. Let's go. Come on. Car started. Let's go! And do we get to keep the masks forever? Yes, we do! Yes! The group notices a geometrically impossible vortex forming in front of the moving car. It hovers a few feet in front of the bumper, at speed, humming ominously. Calculate its vectors? Drive through it or don't mess with it? Okay, what is this event? Seriously, what is this event and what do we have to do? This is what happens when you buy anime! Who cares? Math! No, 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 come on! Non-Euclidean, you say? Math, Kiko, Anim- Seriously, serious answers, what does this do? What check are we doing here? What check are we doing here? No, serious answers. Serious answers. Don't just say calculate, tell me what it does. Now everyone goes quiet when we realize Um, uh, wits is not good. No, uh, oh yeah, his, his wits are pretty good. So, we calculate its vectors. Are you sure? According to Nimbus's calculations, you could chuck someone in here and it would change them, probably not even in a fatal way. He crunches some extra numbers and figures out the optimal way to toss someone in. Who are we tossing in? Who are we tossing into the interdimensional vortex of geometrical stuff? Who are we tossing in? King Edgar? Nimbus could go in. I mean, I think Nimbus should go in personally. I think Nimbus should throw it. Never Nimbus. Why not Nimbus? Why not Nimbus? Because Nimbus is cool. Well, Nimbus can be cooler if we go in there. That's the thing, Nimbus could be even cooler. I mean... Nim Nimbus is the, anim the true anime here. Nimbus should go in. He could come off even better, but Nimbus is going in. Now you've done it! Nimbus Ordeal re-emerges, feeling new and amazing! Oh, look at that! Look at that! I mean, the shooting is useless, 
But look at his strength now! Oh, also, he's called... Oh, because he's backwards! Okay! His wits are garbage now, because all of his stats... It doesn't matter! Look at that! He is now... Ladro Sobmin! Ladro is the new Nimbus, and now he's awesome! Come on, Ladro! We have one fuel. Also, the car is broken down. There's actually really no point in trying to fix it, because we have one fuel. We abandon the car. So, first time we've actually had to walk around, and we only have eight days away, if we had a car. Yeah, we have no fuel either. The weather suddenly turns bad. The group is caught in the open and must keep moving. They have enough umbrellas to go round. Things could have been worse. People say, why do you keep the umbrellas, Kiko? This is why we keep the umbrellas. This is why. After a long walk, the group decides to camp. Fortunately, they're assaulted by mosquitoes. Meh. Morale inc decrease. That's fine. We have three food. While driving along, we find an SUV. They're rubbish, but it's better than nothing. Onwards to Canada, mini golf. They have nearly enough food to eat, doubt festers. In the morning, they find a golf ball. Quick game. Yay! We don't have any food. So, that's not good. However, Nareem can attempt to fix the pumps, though. Nareem attempts to fix the pumps. She gets them pumping in no time. Oh, look at that gas! We have gas. We have a car. We just need food. We have no food. Hey, Trader Camp. How you doing? What do we have here? Hi. We're anime. Ah, it's the, it's, it's, it's the woman that we can sell things to. It's the woman we can sell things to. Hi. Uh, yeah, get rid of them. Hi, how you doing? Um, we have a shotgun for you. Oh yeah, we also have ten of these. We also have a nightstick for you. We can sell these to you and get stuff. I mean, it's not much. Weapons bartering. Great! Um, Sell the nightstick for a food. Sell the shotgun for a food. Oh, it's this one. It's the Renaissance Fair. Oh, we can't do anything in the Renaissance Fair. Oh. This makes me sad. No, the katanas are worth nothing. The katanas are literally junk. <sighs> what are you watching? The best thing ever. We need food. We have lots of decent weapons, but we don't have food. Can I sell this one-use medical sprite? No. I can sell the bat. The sturdy machete is worth three. How long will we live? We're doing pretty well so far. I'm cautiously optimistic. Aluminium bat is one. This is this is a run. This is a run. Oh, so long, HK Trading. We now have three food. Which means we'll just lose morale rather than immediately uh, fail miserably. Hatchets aren't worth anything. We can't sell hatchets. We 
could sell the chainsaw. The grenade launcher we literally bought. Like, I don't want to sell the grenade launcher. We bought that. The slip nose is quite useful. Can't we get pity handouts? Not with one, we can't. I'm gonna ask this. I'm not gonna necessarily do it. How much can we get for the chainsaw? Four? That is really bad. I suppose we're just gonna have to hope we get an event that will help us out. We, we need the rifle. We need the rifle so we have something with rifle fuel, using rifle bullets. There's no point selling the rifle. I suppose you just have to see what pity handouts we can get now. Now we need a shotgun and we need a pistol. We need at least one of all of these because otherwise we're not going to have probably, but you can't guarantee that. That's the thing. Don't go with maybes. Go with definites. Also, are you going to sell food right now? No, you sell shotgun ammo right now. Scoffs at my lack of food. Can't afford anything from this night. We could buy a spare gauntlet, but no thanks. Also you. Yeah, can't do that either. And then there's you. Nope. So... There's also you just walking around. Ooh, a pouch of Welcome gold. to the Renaissance. Good God, what's wrong with ye faces? We could sell the sturdy machete. I mean, not the sturdy machete, the... Um, okay, that that's not a sturdy machete game. That's a snub nose. Thank you. We could sell the snub nose. We're gonna sell the snub nose. The snub nose isn't a huge upgrade over the pistol. We can ha get a food out of that. Don't be a naysayer, not a rogue AI. We'll see how we're doing. Also, did I just put that? I put it away, didn't I? I have pistols. We'll sell the snub nose. We still have pistols. We still have the rifle, the shotgun. Ooh, a pouch of gold. Oh no! Watch out, lads! These anime fans we tried to sell us anime! All right, snub nose. All right, let's go. We have four food. It's gonna have to do. Bye, person. We literally do not need you right now. We have four food. There's gonna be a place we can loot now. Yes, from a dist- Oh, the group sees some skeletons and loot in the middle of a debris locked dot street. Oh, it's this one. Oh, it's this one. Oh no, it's this one. It's this one. And I'm going to keep saying that because it's this one. It's the one with the street where everything terrible happens. All right, rifle, we have a chainsaw. Let's go. This is not good. There's another rifle there. We actually want that quickly. It's something to sell. We'll take that. We'll take that, just to have it. We are going to use the uh, chainsaw soon enough. Very soon, actually. Yep. Chainsaw! Ha <laughs> ha! This is what we need this for. So we can clear these out. We just need to survive for an hour. We want that rifle, actually. We want it so we can sell it. Get you. Ten fuel. Well spent. If it means we live. If it means we live. Just survive. Yep, lots of rifle bullets around. Just, just fire bullets everywhere, to be honest. Five minutes, and we're good. We did it. We survived thanks to the chainsaw.
Ten fuel, well spent. Now, I, I think you'll find that that's a, a Guster sword. I mean, uh, Ladro Subnin uses a Guster sword. Yep, rifles and rifles. I mean, we could have sold, therefore, the rifles we had, but you know. We didn't know this was going to happen. We didn't know. Also, we can now grab stuff. Like you, King Edgar. Grab that rifle. We need this. Now let's go look at these buildings. Oh look! Nothing. Also, rifle ammo. Oh look! Nothing. Th there's literally nothing in any of these buildings. I'm pretty sure every single one of these buildings is a trap. If you go into any of these buildings and stay in them, you'll die. You will die. Do you want us to stop the faces? Eh, you can. We got no food, but we got 40... Well, we didn't get 40 fuel. We lost some fuel. But we survived. And that's the important thing. We didn't die. So hopefully there'll now be an event where we can get some food. Here's the hoping. We now have three rifles. That's two more food. Those are just as dangerous to us as they are the zombies. That's true. Right, we feel inspired. We are going to get... Shooting, morale and random skill gains, or plus two shooting. Because we're not in a good food situation... Yeah, I'm going to go with morale. I'm going to go with morale. We, we're not in a good food situation. So, medical... Ooh. Rohan's medical went up. That was good. And uh, something of yours went up too, Liatro. Uh, I mean, your strength's still good. Your shooting's good. That was good. That was good. Campground? Oh, it's smelly. Good thing we can now endure the smell zone. We're low on food. We need food. Group finds... It's a candy bar! Who has the lowest, lowest morale? That's Liadro. It's good. Makes him feel a little better about his current life in not Canada. Look at our morale, it's just meh. Okay. A swarmed rest stop means food? A swarmed rest stop means food. There's definitely going to be food there. The group finds a rest stop along the road, completely overwhelmed by an angry undead. What could have happened here? Okay. It's gun time again. It's gun time again. Chainsaw time again, too. Actually, is it? No, it's not. We can't afford to bring the chainsaw with us. We can't afford to bring a rifle with us. It's not grenade time. We need to save it. Huh. You know what? the rifle rather than the pistol. It's time for bigger guns. Let's go. They're also irritated. Yep, this does mean they're going to move quickly. This is fine. Let's go. Also, there's a good chance of getting some... Yes! Some food here. Food! Food here. Food here. That's seven food already. Things are looking up. All we need to do is not die. Chansaw time. Oh, no. Hi! That's the room. Oh, you. That's the room. Uh, no, these, these are just masks. We're not actually going to blow up. This is not actually a four anime run. Uh, run. We're fine. 
Yep, that's the room. It's the room with all the stuff that we want. Just gotta clear them out a little bit. And in, 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 in. Just deal with, deal with them. There we go. We're in, we've got food, we've got food, we've got food, we've got food, we've got lots of stuff. That's 15 food. More importantly, that's adult. That went very well. Also in here, toilet fuel. Mm. I'm gonna put that down as a huge success. Any more toilet fuel? Nope. We have, in total, actually we have 16 food. That is two days worth of food right there. This was a triumph. All we have to do now is get out. All we have to do is get out. This, by the way, will be the last part of uh, this stream. Uh, it's getting close to th three hours now. Still more zombies, eh? We'll be continuing this next time. What will happen next time in Death Road to Canada Q? The Q is just there to make it sound dramatic. Get out alive, and that's what we did. 16 food, one medical, loads of bullets. The answer was anime. <sighs> Look at that. We have food. It is no longer hopeless. We have hope. A tiny slither. And adult. But still hope. I mean, we're not doing great on ammunition, actually. We're doing okay for ammunition. We live another day. That we do. We're only six driving days away from Canada. Also, the engine's not doing great on this car. We have 70 fuel. Why is Nimbus's name spelled backwards? Oh, oh. Uh, portal, portal shenanigans. I'm just going to say portal shenanigans. This stream is ridiculous in the best way possible. The main way. Yep. De no. No MDB. No. I mean, our morale may be meh. But we can, we can, you know, use sieges to improve our morale. We'll be fine. We're only six days away from Canada. Dimensional shenanigans. And we have a stick and healing sprays and a turret and a grenade launcher and a chainsaw. I mean, all of that is encouraging. And we have a pretty strong team. I mean, I mean, your fitness is great. Your, your strength could uh, do with some increases, but your fitness and shooting are fantastic, even though you can't shoot a gun. I mean, your strength is okay. And you're here. I mean, if if uh, Nareem dies, you're the replacement mechanic. You even need a rat and a stick now? Well, we got it anyway. And so, folks, thank you very much for being here. You know what? I, I played Doom 2016. I enjoyed it quite a bit. Next time, we will return and finish this run and hopefully not die. Also, because we should probably spend all of this before we uh, conclude, we can actually spend our... Um, our uh, ooh, we actually spend our stuff while we are here. And uh, that's not the button. Is that the button? I have no idea what button to use uh, when I'm controlling with the keyboard. Hey. When you're controlling with the keyboard, what button do you use? That one. Figured it out. We can actually buy Dingus Savant. And we're gonna buy Dingus Savant. Always destined for great things, never bothered to work for it. Gets one point, bonus point to maximum for all skills, takes one less hit than normal, minus two penalty to max morale, and luck. Does what I'm deserves extra exposure. I agree. Also, oh, Bob. Buy it, make room for more Zombo points. That's what I did. And so, folks, thank you very much for being here, everyone. It was great. It got silly. I asked you about Vortex Portal thingamies. And now, we are ready to go with the final bit. The final bit that you all know what's coming, where I talk about random things. Paul can even make any pet super trade. That's cool. First off, there is my serialized story, the Threnody of Dusseldorf, where 
you can read my writing. Oh, the first time my writing's ever been up there. Anime fan art com Oh no, Deus. Oh no. It's gonna be the best and the worst simultaneously. You can read it all there. I'm slowly working on editing it, but uh, you can check what's there there. All the story from start to finish. There's also my Discord, where you can join and be part of a large, thriving, friendly community. We've got community LPs, we have tabletop sessions, we have sections to talk about my writing, my streams, my Let's Plays, and all manner of other things, as well as emotes from streams and Let's Plays past and present. Also, yep, the emotes are so amazing! They, they really are. They're absolutely awesome. Also, if you link your Twitch and Discord together and you're subscribed on Twitch, you can use your Twitch emotes there, and that's pretty cool! You know what else is cool? My Patreon. Why? Because you can use it to pledge to support me in doing what I do! There's nothing hidden behind paywalls. I started all those years ago with everything being available for everything, for everyone for free, and that's how I intend to keep things going, but I do rely on the people that do pledge to me, for they do make what I do a reality. They really do. This is my full-time job, but there's a lot of stuff that goes on behind the scenes. Lots of uh, editing, compression, uh, testing for things, and stuff to make sure that everything runs smoothly. This is my... It, it takes up pretty much nearly every day of my week. I don't get days off, except maybe Sunday. Pretty much the only day in the week where I don't do something related to content creation. So, those who do pledge to me not only get my deep and sincere thanks for making what I do possible, they also get a different colour name on Discord just to show... What? Just to show that they do and that they're awesome, rather. <laughs> I fear what the VOD title will be. Oh, I've got to think about that. I've got to think about that hard. It's going to be good. Also, there is my YouTube. I've nearly been doing this for 13 years. At the end of this month, it will be my 13 year anniversary. And we have over 300 playlists and over 8,000 videos for you to watch. Thank you all, Dragon for the Ham. Greatly appreciate it. I mean, if you could convert that into actual food for my run, that'd be fantastic. Um, if you like my stuff, why not check it out at that link and subscribe? Get your friends to do it! Get all their friends to do it! And if you get to 100,000 YouTube subscribers, I will, and it's a promise, do a replay of Terror from the Deep. That is definitely a promise. I will do it. You can hold me to it. I'll do it. And also, there is my Twitter, where you can follow me to get notifications about when my Let's Play videos go up, when my streams start and all kinds of other things, including a smattering of Animal Crossing here and there. Just a tiny little bit, you know, a couple of, uh, a couple of things. 13 years? This is remarkable, yeah? I I'm long in the tooth when it comes to content creation, one of the old guard. I was there when my videos were only like 3 360p was good. And my videos were 80 megabytes big. I took 20 minutes to upload. And you had to squint at them to, to see them and, and... Your ears had to deal with all the static from my poorly grounded computer. It wasn't good because of the quality and the limitations of the time, but the content was still me, and so it was good. The quality of the video and audio wasn't, is what I'm saying. Everything else, I like to think, was good. And 10 minutes long. Oh, no, no. 10 minutes, 59 seconds long. You could get, you can get away with that. There's also a little bit of Animal Crossing there on Twitter, but you know, that's, that's the thing. And finally, I need to thank all of you for, if it wasn't for you, I couldn't do all of this. Whether you pledge to me on Patreon, subscribe on Twitch, subscribe on YouTube, or just watch my stuff quietly in the background and lurk. I appreciate all of you because you are the heart and soul of my content, the heart and soul of my community, and if you enjoy it, then it has succeeded in what I've set out to do, entertain. And in the end, that's what all my stuff is for your entertainment. And so, whether it be morning, afternoon, or evening, you made Hills Far fun to watch. There's the achievement. Thank you very much, not a rogue AI. Whether it be morning, afternoon, or evening, I hope you have a good rest of your day, and I hope you achieve everything you set out to do. Tomorrow is the final stream of the week, Animal Crossing New Horizons. It's Saturday, 2 p.m. GMT. We'll be working on uh, Doc's garden, because Hazel has gone, and Doc will be taking his place, but he won't have moved in yet. So we have time to deal with that. As well as all the normal adorableness that you've come to expect. Who knows? We may even get some photos. And the next stream after that will be Monday, and that will be Terraria, 7pm GMT. Maybe we'll actually build a proper arena and have a second uh, poke at dealing with the Destroyer. We may give it a go. And so, 
I'll catch you next time, folks, and I'll see you then. Later. Also, watch out for the zombie! Mm.